The first living cells on Earth were prokaryotes, they contained no DNA in a nucleus and no organelles. According to Lynn Margulis's theory, the process of endosymbiosis evolved prokaryotes into eukaryotes. Evidence supports the idea that eukaryotes were formed from a prokaryote engulfing another prokaryote, such as a bacterium within another bacterium. Endosymbiosis, a cell living within another cell as they both benefit from each other, is what evolved the prokaryotes into eukaryotes. Eukaryotic cells contain DNA in a nucleus and have a mitochondria, the powerhouse of the cell. The formation of eukaryotes led to the creation of multicellular organisms. It is believed that mitochondrions and chloroplasts were their own cells. Evidence shows that mitochondria contain their own circular DNA genome and can reproduce, and that chloroplasts, only found in plant cells, convert sunlight into food. Also, all cells must be able to produce energy. The mitochondria produces energy and respiration, regulates metabolism, and can reproduce itself, was it its own organism?